Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I wanted to address the most common question that us vegans and plant eaters get, and that is, where do you get your protein? Where is their protein found in the plant foods you're eating? So in today's culture, in today's society, we are so fixated on the macronutrient of protein. And, and, and it's just solely focused on protein because in our social media and the, the people and the things that we are surrounded by and the things that we get bar bombarded with in regards to advertisements and commercials, it's all about protein. It's all about eating high protein. So the main question we get is where do you get your protein because it's so ingrained in us that that's what we have to focus on that's what we need to survive so a very quick sum up is that you can get all the essential protein that your body needs to survive and to thrive by not including high protein foods or meals all whole plant foods contain the three macronutrients that you need to live and to survive and to thrive carbohydrates protein and fats. All whole foods are compromised of those three things and alongside that you get all of the vitamin, vitamins and minerals, coenzymes, enzymes, phytochemicals, phytonutrients. Um, today's culture we specifically focus on protein as the most important thing but it's really not. You don't have to worry about getting in enough protein or worrying about making sure you're eating enough protein because you will get enough protein that your body requires as long as you are eating enough calories, enough energy that your body requires. You will get, you will get all the protein that your body needs. Our human body needs at least 5% of your calories coming from protein in order to be healthy. And that is so easy to do, even if you were just eating super low protein foods all day, like most fruits um, and some vegetables. If you were just living off of fruits, if you are a fruitarian, you are more than easily getting enough protein for your body to thrive and survive. Now, it's most commonly mistaken as well that you need to eat a high amount of protein if you want to gain muscle. That's not true either. Just eat a moderate, healthy amount of protein and you don't even need to fixate on it. Like I said, as long as you are eating an abundance, meaning you are eating the proper necessary amount of calories for your body, there's no need to worry about protein. It will just be there. It will be automatically there. You just you don't have to think about it. It will be there. So again, all you need is at least 5% of your daily calories coming from protein. And you can easily get that without worrying about protein powders or high protein foods. Just make sure you're eating enough calories. All whole foods have carbohydrates, protein, and fats. So they're all compromised of these three macronutrient ratios. Whole grains, beans, nuts and seeds, fruits, vegetables, and root vegetables all have protein. As long as you are eating enough, you will get enough protein. So don't worry about fixating on the protein. You will get more than enough as long as you are eating enough. There's no such thing recorded in history as being protein deficient or having a protein deficiency. So I hope you guys found this video helpful. If you did, don't forget to hit the like button there. And if you're new here to my channel, subscribe for more because I help you guys live a healthy vegan lifestyle. I will see you next time. Bye.